Yeah, it's only the part 52. On the last episode, we finally caught Mewtwo, and that was a pain. So, I said last episode that we were going to try to catch Moltres, but that sounds like it's going to take a lot of walking. So the first thing I want to do is catch a Ditto so I can breed my Blaziken. Supposedly, now in Generation... whatever this is, 14. In Generation 14, now you have the ability to breed Hidden Abilities. Oh, perfect! So, I'm going to be breeding my blades to get either get the nature I want, or... Quick ball. Sorry. To either get, like... To either A, get the nature I want, and the hidden ability, or B, train them off for something... Ah, man, really? Or B, to train them off for something else I want. You're set up to kill me. Yep, can I thunder wave you now? I mean, you are me. What? All my Pokemon are dead. I don't want to bother going back home. And I can't... You're still alive, Garchomp. <laughs> Everyone's dead. Oh, uh, well, gentlemen, this is an issue. Okay, so how to kill it? Wow. Okay, I, I guess I have literally no moves I can hurt. I can hurt myself. That's a little, a little awkward. All right, let's try this again. Okay, I think the nicest way to hurt him is fly. How are you faster than me? What the? Ah! I'm gonna catch you. Probably should you know, have a better definitive strategy when I do this. Gabby came in, this is stupid. Fine, nope. Fine! I'm gonna thunderbolt you. If it doesn't work, I'm going to leave and come back. How come he keeps getting to move before me? I'm faster. And I'm a jerk. Maybe I should just run from- yeah, let's try that. Alright. I'm about to speed this up. However, I'm gonna walk towards that Pokeball since I think it's only Yellow Roses I need to be in. No, Alright, I'm gonna speed up until I can find a Ditto. So just give me a second. Nice, but not really what I'm looking for. Come on, Ditto! Oh, what the? Ew. That thing is gross. But I must catch it. Hopefully, this won't kill you. Oh, wait, crap, I'm 20 levels. I'm 20 levels bigger than you. Why couldn't you use, like, stockpile or something? Yeah, that was poor planning on my part. Well, is that a use Brick Break? That would have took me forever. Alright, sorry. Let's keep speeding up. There we go! Yes! I was like, please! Please, Quick Ball! Fighting dittos are painful! Alright, now we just gotta go to the... Right, forget where it is now. Cool. As the ability reconstitutes entire cellular structure to transform into whatever it sees. Uh, no. Alright, now let's head to the daycare center, which I don't actually remember where it is. I think it was near the beginning. Fuck on daycare. There we go. Alright. We need to head to Camp Fear Town. Okay, where are you? you? You're almost dead, but it's okay. So give me a second, I'll be right at the daycare. All right, here we are. Wait a second. That's right. I forgot. Hold on. 
and put Lucario back in. We left Snorlax in here! Snorlax! Buddy! Take back! Yes! Yeah, whatever. Okay, Pokemon. Wow, you only grew that that much, really? Oh. Um. Okay, I'm actually kind of semi disappointed. Rest, snore, sleep, talk. That's. Snorlax, you, you sort of failed me. Alright. Leave Pokemon. I want you to take. What's your summary? You're. Quirky. Ah, I don't really want Quirky. So, if I wanted Quirky, I would have had Ditto hold an Everstone. And he holds. Ooh, Metal Powder. Hold on. Let me see what that is. Bag. Item. Metal Powder. Just give, give me it. Um, how do you say... Okay, take. Alright. I would have had Ditto hold an Everstone. However, since he doesn't have the ability, any ability I want, I'm just gonna, like, let it go on random and kind of hope for the best. So leave Ditto. Yes. I want you to take Blaziken. Bye, Blaziken! Yep, and now I'm just gonna check back later. Alright, so now on to Moltres. Withdraw. I'm probably gonna need Dish. I'm not gonna need Venusaur. And, um... Hmm, what do I need? Let's see. Oh, oops. So I wonder, like, hold on, something's not right. Take you back. This should really... When I go to power... I don't think there should be a deposit and withdrawal thing. I think you should just have that at the side so you could just really quick just go back and forth. I think that'd be easy. But anyhow. Alright. Alright. So from my experience in roaming Pokemon, which I have cop in the past and have been a paid, they will always hop around. Every time you enter a oops. Every time you enter a route or enter a leave ability to use fly, they randomize. However, I have heard... Where am I looking for? Kurai, here we go. We, I have heard that um, in Pokemon X and Y, they now do consecutive routes, but they still change. So, what's to be done? Well, the first thing you need to know is that roaming Pokemon are not affected by max repels. They are not. They are not. That's very important. Wait, hold on, this might not be the right way. Give me a second. So, let's keep talking. Since they are not affected by max repels, you can essentially max repel an area, and then you're home free, and you're only going to encounter it. Yep, 19. So, I did a little bit of research. And this is... Oh! Okay, whatever. Oops, wait, I just realized what. I don't have max repels. Sorry, sorry. Don't want it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run in and out of a gate with a max repel going through grass. Within theory, it should randomize enough and that since I have max repels, I should run into a Pokemon eventually that I want. And then, once we have that done, if I could talk straight, we need by type. Thing is though, with Moltres, you need to encounter it 10, either 10 or 11 times. We've already encountered it once. Yeah, where is that? There it is, Max Repel. We've already encountered it once, so we need to encounter it 10 more times. Once it does that, it'll go to a specific cave and stay there. So, basically, once you find it, it'll run away instantly and you have to do it again. So what I'm going to do is I'm going... Sorry, one more thing, very important. I, I just can't talk straight, so I won't calm down. What you also need to do is once you find it in that certain route, just keep finding it. Do not leave that route for any reason whatsoever. Do not leave it. You must stay in that route and find it 10 more times. Okay? So I'm going to speed up, and if anything cool happens, I'll tell you, but probably not. Use. Alright. 
So, I'll be right back. Let's see how this goes. Actually, you know what? What I described was the first way. I'm going to go for the second way. Let's see if we can. The second way is just to not use fly whatsoever and to manually hunt it down. I didn't think you could see it with the Pokedex. Apparently, you can. Which makes you go, hold on. Uh, no. It just makes you go, hold on, everyone stop. I didn't think you could, could because the first time I tried, it was like, oh, this is stupid. I can't find him. And now, you might have saw me when I sped up. I just did it on a whim, thinking, eh, maybe I can. It's staying right there. So I'm going to, from here, run all the way over here. So, give me a second, and we're going to hunt Moltres down. Because hopefully, it'll stay in consecutive spots as long as we don't use it to move fly. So, give me a second. Oh, hey, he's on the same route as I am. Alright, first off, I just kind of want to apologize. I mean, I just realized I kind of sounded a little unprofessional. So, first off, I just want to say sorry. It's just like, you know, you write your script for yourself. But, well, I didn't write it. I said it to myself twice. And then you try saying it, and it's just like, ah, no. It's kind of what I feel like right now. Oh, 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 and then you'll notice, Moltres immediately flies away. By the way, you might also be wondering what the distribution for them is. Moltres, I chose Froakie, so I got Moltres. I believe, I could be wrong, I want to say, say Moltres, let's see. I believe if you choose, whatever that one chess Pokemon is called, wait, is it on here anymore? The one, Chespin? Yeah, Chespin, I think you get Zapdos, and then Fennekin, you get Articuno. Where'd you go, buddy? What the? How'd you get over there? Alright, we don't want to use Fly, because that's going to reset everything. So we need to sprint all the way back over there. This is why I wanted to put Ditto and Bla Blaze again, so I can hopefully get an egg. This is why. Because I'm like, okay, this is ridiculous. Alright, so I'm going to sprint all the way back. And I don't understand Lumio City, apparently. This place is messed up, seriously. Okay. Erg, it's running away from me. It should be important to tell you guys that it is a very important thing to constantly check your Pokedex. <laughs> because I didn't check my Pokedex, as you saw, and I ran all the way over there, and then he left. He is... It is moving. It does move. <laughs> Doesn't always move, but it does. But many times, Moltres will. So it's a bit of an issue. Also, I'm going to have to say, this is a lot better than the movie in fourth. I remember in Pokemon Emerald, I think it was, I was trying to catch either Latios or Latios. Latios or Latias, I can't remember which one. And this is like all, uh, and just going in and out was like the only way to do it. That one, it was randomized, so I had to. But still, it was painful. This, the hunt... Whew, there it is, there it is, there it is. Way better, way better. I'm sorry if I misled you guys, and if someone's going to come back and yell at me and say, in your first 10 seconds, you said X, and I'm going to say, yeah, that's. I just pretty much told you one way to do it, and I'm going to tell you my way of doing it. What the? It ran. Ah. I'm going to get back over there. Sorry, give me a second. And it went back. Must have flew over our head without me even noticing. Okay. Is there like a quick way to go Pokedex? That'd be nice. I just want the Pokedex of Moltres. <laughs> ah, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, sorry. Speed up till I can get to the right spot. Wait a second. I don't think I've even actually been down this path before. Really? Yeah, I, I, I might not. I don't, rem I don't remember this. I bet if I talk to the trainers, they'll challenge me to battles. What's this? Yeah, I bet they will. Alright. Nah! Okay. I don't really care. Sorry, because we gotta focus on killing Moltres. So, I'm gonna keep speeding this up. I'm sorry. I thought we explored all the paths. 
We'll explore this afterwards because there's still a few different spots I want to go to, but Moltres is our top priority. Wait. Ah. Look, now's not the time. Okay? Now is not the time. I'm trying to catch Moltres. And everyone's be running around like, look, look, this, this little Pokemon. Look, fishing area. Look, fairy tale trainer. No. Ah, speed up. None of you guys care about this. Seriously, we gotta catch Moltres. Oh, wait, hey. Wait, hey. Moltres is on my path. I was like, come on, guys. I think I'm stuck here. Literally, I think I'm stuck here. We'll explore this place later, but for right now. Where's my Max Repel? Max Repel. Maybe that one Pokemon that you accidentally killed stole it. Yeah, I killed Phantom. Well, it used Curse on me, so I had to switch out Drift Blim. Never. I don't. Why do I not have Lanoon with me? I'm gonna get Lanoon. Hi, Moltres! Hi there! I wanna be your friend. Not really. I wanna be your friend. God, jerk. Wait, Scotty, where is he now? Scan indicates that he is directly south of Lumio City. Excellent. Follow him. However, he's actually kind of close enough that I'm thinking he might try to fare. He might try to get out again. So he might be back on this route. Nope, no, nope. He's actually down there. All right, let's go. All right, good. He's on the same. He's on the same route. I keep out adventure quotes going through. It's like, sorry, boss. He ferreted. No, he rabbited. What? So I can tell by the look on your face that you just love Pokemon. I will rip you in half. I'm looking for a creature called Moltres. Leave before I kill you. Oh my goodness, really? I'm almost, with no exaggeration, 10 levels bigger than him. See, moments like this should happen in in Pokemon games, but you should be on the receiving end. <laughs> be, be like, yeah, I accidentally went up against a champion. Die. Just, just die. Uh oh, ah, that, that, that's gonna take longer. Just kill it. Sorry, Gabe. Alright. Where is he? Where is he? There we go! Not really, Moltres. I want to be your friend. Come on. I know you wanna. Jerk. Okay. Sensors in the... See if I can do a bow droid voice from, like, stars. Sensors in... Sensors indicate that he is currently in... Give it a minute, the sensors are buffering. He is currently on the complete other side of the planet. Initiate... Eh. <laughs> Initiate... Eh. I'm bored now. <laughs> Initiate course to intercept... Sensors indicate that he is within the same proximity. Max, why are you still talking like a robot? Because it's fun! Because, you know, sometimes I get the impression you people are sick of my voice. Really? I don't know. Ooh! Thank you. Hi! How's it going? I want to be your friend. Just, 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 just let me throw a quick, nah. <laughs> just let me throw a quick ball, that's all I ask. Is that really so much to ask? Is it? Really? Okay. And he is over there. Thanks a lot. Yeah, thanks. Alright, we must race over there immediately. Let's go. So I'm getting the distinct impression I don't know about you people, that every time I use the monorail, 
it randomizes because he jumped like three times. You saw me. I went back and forth and back and forth, but I think every time you hit up the monorail, it randomizes it. So let's not do that. I mean, he'll probably now be on the other side of the monorail, and my phone just went off. I'm going to ignore it. So let me just speed up and figure out what's going on. All right, good news, guys. As I'm chasing Moltres, who was a complete jerk and doubled back and doubled back again, I am now father or granddaddy. I got egg. Let's look at it. Egg. <laughs> It is a egg. <laughs> yep. That's all I got. It's an egg. <laughs> Alright, so basically I'm just gonna hold on to it until it evolves. While I continue to go for a mad rash for that mole trace. And then once it hatches, hopefully I'll be able to go back and get another egg. But something in me is guessing that's not how it works. I might have to take him out, put him back in, I don't know. So, let's keep rushing around. Alright, finally, he's on the same route uh, as. Sorry, same route as me. That was irritating. He's like, come on! Run this way, then run this way, then run this way, then run this way, then run this way. But now you're mine. There is no escape. Moltres! Come on! We can be buddies. Best! Friends. Or not. You hate me! Alright. Analysis. Oh, there he is! <laughs> He's like right over there. Right? It's close by. We should be able to get there quickly. Okay, so just give me a second. How did he get all the way over there? Okay, if I go back, this is gonna reset again, so I'm gonna have to just go full circle. And I just found a cleanse tag on accident while going through the swamp, so that's pretty neat. Sorry, keep going. Yes! Yes! I was like, ah, finally, I just made it through that swamp! And I, my max repel is still on, so. Uh, yes. Yeah. Never mind, I lied. Uh, there you are! Da -da 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 Hello, Moltres. This has been a long and arduous... Is that the right word? Arduous? This has been a long and painful battle between us. I will find you. You there, man that used to be in a bush. Can you just simply tell me which way Moltres went? It would simplify a lot of things. Like me having to go all the way over there now. But I will. For justice. How can you hear that? They can hear that. Okay. Okay, there. And I think I might have just discovered a new path again, because I just saw a sky train. Ah, ah! Alright. Sorry, we gotta keep going. We gotta catch him. Oh, wait, hey, 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 hey. Right path. I'm on the right path. I'm on the right path. You know, I just got mentally thinking, like, oh, we got, I bet fighting this trainer just caused it to run away. No, no. Come to me. You are on this path, right? I be looking at their scanners, and their scanners be saying that you are dirt here. I don't want to go that way because I can see a different path. <laughs> Come on. Yes. What? No! 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 Ah! No! Ah! Go away. I'm trying to catch a mole trace. Back to speeding up land. Yes! Finally! Okay, another thing I think I've learned about this that is very, very important is that if you battle for whatever reason, it does not matter. I mean, wow, I'm running out of max repels. That's not good off stock up. It does not matter what 
The reason is, if you battle a wild Pokemon, a trainer, it will reset. And Moltres will make a run for it. So, having enough repels is just that much more important. You know, I haven't been keeping count. Anyway. Okay. Please just be like one round over. You're all the way over there. You. I hate you. In that case, since I have to go all the way around, what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to go inside a Poke Center and then buy stuff and then see where he turns up. So, let me speed up again. This is a really... Huh? What's going on? Oh! 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 Oh, he's right! Oh! 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 What is it? Oh my goodness, it's a baby Torchic! Please do not spam this channel for eggs. Uh, no. I mean, maybe I will trade Torchics to people and have giveaways. And giveaways, but for right now, let's just say no. I may be in the future, maybe. If you offer me something that I want. Oh, see, like I have speed boost. And it's naive. Okay, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, cool. I got another egg. That's awesome. Alright. Sorry, back to work. Yes! Alright, good. He's in the same route as me. Now, something I've actually discovered, you're just kind of like mentally thinking this while I am, um, I went to got my get my egg, is that flying is not a bad thing to do. It sounds strange, since it's like, but it resets, but it's not a bad thing. I mean, okay. Let's take, um, I'm gonna have to open up my map to show you. Yeah, you better run. I'm coming for you, Moltres. And you're irritating me, which is making your life it's about to be worse. Well, your life will now be worser. Crazy. There he is. Alright, now, like, this area over here, since the monorail resets it, you have to go all the way around, as opposed to this area where you just go fum 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 just nice straight paths. When it's over here, it's like pain and misery and death. And there's loads of areas that have like Pokemon, so you need max repels. That's why it, sometimes if you're just like if he's over here, which is a bad spot, just fly anyway, so just so you can reset it. I suggest flying to like the center, just so you can go all right straight paths. This is fairly simple. All right, sorry. Right, let's now get to route 22 so I can take my revenge on Moltres. Alright, good. I actually accidentally made a mistake and went back into town so that this actually worked out fairly well. Come on. There we go. Moltres, the hatred for you is starting to fester. I like you. You're a really nice... I've, I always liked the original birds, but really... I'm starting to get sick of your nonsense. <laughs> I do not like roaming Pokemon. It's just, it's painful. It's a lot better, in my case at least, to have a Pokemon that's just very hard and painful to catch, not to get there. And he's over there now, which looks like it can make a straightaway path. I mean, it's not over here, so I have to get through. Yeah, Connecting Cave is short. I was like, oh, hold on. <laughs> yeah, I can make that. Alright, give me a second. Okay, that was weird. I thought I had Max Repels going. I saw a Doduo, so I caught it. Just wanted to show you guys. A two-ending Pokemon that was discovered as a sudden mutation. It runs at a pace of over 60 miles per hour. No one else runs at over 60 miles per hour? Moltres! I'm gonna kill him. Yes. Moltres. Oh, Moltres! Big old buddy pal of mine, Moltres! I will find you! Has anyone seen the Man of Steel movie? Every time I want to find something that goes to my head, it's like, I will find him! I have found you, Moltres. Well. I really hope I'm done with this already. Like, is it number 10 yet? 
Oh, no, let's see where he is. <gasps> yes! He is at Sea Spirit's Den. Alright, now you don't need to worry about flying. We successfully cowed him into Sea Spirit's Den. Remember a long time ago when I was like, Hey, what are this cage for right there with the cave? Yep, that's what that is for. I wonder if I could fly there. That'd be great. Sea Spirit, by the way, is a reference to Lugia, which I don't think, I don't think appears in this game, actually. I don't know. I think this is the last legendary I can actually legitly catch, so, you know. Alright, gotta get my team together, and I'll head right over there. You know, I actually think Mewtwo wouldn't do that bad. Really? Yeah, I don't think he would, actually. Because what do I do? Paralyze. Switch out to... Yeah, I'd switch out to Garchomp, and then just Brick Break, and then Mewtwo probably would do pretty good with phasing. I mean, he can do Recover. I don't know. He's big. He's strong. He's a legendary. I think he'll do fine. Alright, let's see if I can fly over there. Okay, fly. Nope, won't let me. Alright, speed up while I get over there. Alright. He's right in there. Save! Alright, go in here, Pokemon. Pokemans. Alright, so here's the plan. Driflin will first come in with a Thunder Wave. A Thunder Wave. Then we'll send in Garchomp or Lucario, either one, who will then promptly start hitting him up with um, fighting attacks, which he should be resistant against. And then finally, we'll probably use Greninja to phase him out while we throw Dusk Balls like Maniacs. But first, we're gonna throw a quick ball. Yeah, I certainly hope so. Moltres says, I am finally sick of your nonsense, Max. Oh dear. You are going down. Oh! So close. That was so close. If I quick ball this, that would be so perfect. Come on! Nope, well, it was worth a shot. <laughs> Good to know. Okay, fight, Thunder Wave. Yeah! Oh dear. Ugh. That is strong. But hey, at least now he's paralyzed. Okay, yep. Smack. That was a, that was actually pretty good. Wait, heat wave? Doesn't that lower your special attack? Hee <laughs> hee hee hee. Okay, actually, if I can succeed in flying two more times, sunny day. That's. That could be bad. Especially if you know Solar Beam. Wait, we're in a cave. How is he... How is he doing that when we're in a cave? Yeah, now you safeguard. Good one. Actually, I don't want to risk it. Really? I don't... Yeah, I don't think so. Alright, so better back out. Send in Garchomp. Garchomp's Brick Break should do next to nothing. Okay, fight. Brick Break. If it doesn't, I'm going to shut this thing down as quick as possible and cry to myself a little bit. Oh, 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 pain, 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 death. Wow, that didn't actually do that much. Okay. Good. Perfect. Oh, it's not sunny in a cave anymore. What? Never mind. Okay, Pokeball. Let's see. Dusk Ball. We are in a cave. Come on. Don't be like Mewtwo and take, like, I think it actually took an hour. Okay, bang. Come on. 
The only way I could possibly do better is if I top stumbled false swipe, which in hindsight I probably should have. Erg. Okay, come on, bag. Dust ball. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ding. Yes. Thank you, God. What trace is mine? Yay, Lucario. Ha. Ha. I feel pretty good. It is said to be the legendary bird heard Pokemon fire. Every flap of its wings creates a dazzling flare of flames. No. All right, now there is one, two, three things. Nope. Nothing else. Okay. Okay. There are three last things I want to show you, and then I think this walkthrough is over. It's over? I think so. How you doing? It doesn't seem close to hatching. Sadness. Okay. Okay, let's go back here. So he tells me I have another egg. I'm tired, what? <laughs> yeah, you got like three eggs now. Please tell me when this happened. Oh, like ten minutes ago. Right. Okay, first, I want to look at Moltres, make sure he's not holding anything. Then I'm going to speed up and head to the daycare. Well, actually, I'm just going to show you something that's near the daycare. Oh, I have no idea what fairy juice is. I think it's just like Healy juice. Okay, where? There you are. Rash, safeguard, air slash, sunny day, heat wave. Yep, you see the big deal. Nothing really special in there. Alright. Then I need. Okay, sorry. I'll speed this up and head over there. So just give me a second. Wait. I was kidding. He actually does have an egg. Alright, sorry. I gotta. I gotta get that egg. I was not expecting that. I mean, I still have another egg. Alright, give it a Garchomp. Lucario and Driftlin can probably handle almost anything. There's an Eggapalooza going on here. Yeah, totally. All the eggs in the world. Alright. I wanted just to give a really quick explanation on this place. The Battle Chateau, and then do one battle. The Battle Chateau is basically a place where you can go like up and down floors and you can meet various people that are barons and stuff, and eventually you can like re meet gym leaders. Then what you do is you just battle them, and occasionally they give you items that are worth a bunch of money, and you just keep going. So really, in the end, it's just a place to battle and make more money, because in most Pokemon games, there's like, it's considered you have like a set amount of money because um, of trainers, because that's the main way to get money, and then after the access is kind of hard. Yeah, whatever, Baron, I don't... Yeah, I just hit the camera. <laughs> and then depending on like... And then depending on how many times you win, eventually you like rise in the ranks and you can meet different people and get better and better stuff and the battles get harder and harder. So it's really just like a challenge place to make money for fun. And I mean, look, I'm getting experience too, so what's wrong with that? And I feel really bad that these Pokemon are so low level. Sorry! The next thing I wanted to talk about was hotels and restaurants. Basically, I don't even need to really bother going to one. Could it be feeling my heartbeat? Yeah, whatever. Basically, what those are are places that you bat, are places that you battle, and then you. It says like if you could do it in a certain amount of. Actually, I'll see if I can find one. They're places that you can like battle, and if you do it in a, if you do the battle exactly in a certain amount of turns, you get this bonus. You know, I haven't been here in so long. They're all dead. <laughs> Oh, wow! So I guess this kind of teaches you guys. Pay attention to your plans. And I'm not really, I don't think I'm going to be doing a video on berries just because I never could really give a, give a care enough. 
about berries. I like leftovers way too much. Let's see if I can find a... Is this hotel? Where you can taste the ages. Mmm, tastes like dust. Okay. Oh. I might be... Oh, never mind. I don't think it's hotels. I think it's just restaurants. Wow. This means I should have explored all the hotels. I probably would have... Let me just sit on your bed. I probably would have gotten some nice stuff. Wait, what did you say? I never dropped the balls. As... Okay. Wait, you again! Uh, no, I don't care about old powers. It's bundant time! I don't care! Yeah, I... I don't give care- I don't give enough cares about old powers to really investigate. <laughs> really? No, I just- I just don't. There comes a point where you're just like, there's so much going on, I could really care less. Right, so I guess I really should have explored hotels. Let's see, I should find a restaurant. Eh, you guys get the idea. Basically, it is battles that they say, do this in specific amount of turns. If you do, you get mushrooms, and these mushrooms can be, like, sold to people to get certain clothes. And I just dropped my stylus. So you can go fancier. When you went to the hotel, the one guy said, like, you are not stylish enough. It just means you weren't wearing stylish enough clothes. Like, every clothes has, like, a stylish rating. So the more and more expensive, the more and more stylish. The thing is, though, I don't really give a care because my guy looks pretty spiff right now. So it's not really worth investigation. Do you know what I mean? No? All right, fine, we'll leave it. So let's just leave the subject. Now, the next thing we're going to do is see if I go to my map we're going to find what this is chamber of emptiness a mysterious void is said that nothing can exist within I told you guys since the beginning that that is just a challenge accepted so now that I got two eggs which is awesome I really I really hope I get a torchic with adamant and speed boost that would make my day that would seriously, like, really, really make my day. So now we're going to explore Route 22, right? Yeah, it's Route 22. Until we can find a path to get to that area, because no doubt something cool is in there. What could be in there? I don't know, but I bet it's cool. Max, you have a problem, don't you? I've been doing this video for so far. Yeah, getting bull chase took an hour and a half. <laughs> Not to say that I'm not happy that I'm done, but still, at the same time, I'm just like, Ugh. Shoot me now. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's see you south of this area. Oops. So, so. Hey, what's this? Water. Water. Waterfall. Whee! Uh, okay. I don't wanna... Ha ha, I snuck by you! And some strength puzzles, alright. Seems simple enough. Three rocks, three holes. Well, this one obviously goes down there, so... So, bloom. I want that TM. Okay, go around. Oh! Nope. There. See? Easy. Okay, now let's see if we can figure out this next one. Oh, I get it. Okay. See, now we go around. Ah! No! I got the feeling from you and your Pokemon that you really know your business. Let's find out. 
I don't know nothing about nothing. No, 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 I don't know. Really, I'm an idiot. You, you don't need to get near me. It's all perfectly fine. Just, just, just leave me alone. <laughs> Wait, hold on. It took a waterfall to get down here. And your eyeball just went to your gills. You should be higher than level 30. A am I the only one that noticed this? Just, just me? The question marks are endless in Max's mind! Okay. Wow, you're good! You took my pride and smashed into- Do <laughs> you remember that little bit of heartfelt joy that I used to have? Yeah, it's gone now! Oh, dear. What happened to it? Oh, well, you know. You. Oh, oh thanks. Okay. Go. See? Easy. Okay, and then go over here. Now I gotta run around. There we go, that was simple enough. Oh my oh, oh, oh. Earthquake! Now I get Earthquake. Man, I've been wanting this for a while. Wait a second. I could just hop over. Never mind. Ah! Uh. That thing looks hideous. Yeah, I liked it better when it stands up. But I already got your pre-evolution, so don't need it. Do do do. Whoa, hey! I'm the friends people from whom I can learn something. Well, iron sharpeneth iron, I guess. Yeah, Lucario. That's so cool. But your yeah, friend. The friends, yes, should teach you things. You should not have a friend that drags you down. You should only have friends that bring you up. So, yeah, I guess you can legitimately say what you say. It's just kind of, when you say it, it makes it sound like you're a jerk. Because I only make friends with people who teach me things. You better teach me things, you ungrateful lout. I don't even know if lout's an insult. And I sit there and I go, you're kind of mean. You deserve this smackdown. And finally, Drift Film's level 70. Nobody cares, Quagsire. <laughs> wow, you're incredible. Hands be friends. I can learn a lot from about you. Hey, let me, let me just be your friend. No. I don't like you. Chamber of Emptiness. This could be bad. Do I take the bait? Take the bait! A spooky plate. Re really? Okay, fine. Ha! Is anything here? Is this it? Huh. Isn't this where you're supposed to get, like... Really? This is... Kind of depressing. I thought there was, like, a Pokeball here or something. Well, what's supposed what's supposed to be here is uh, what do what's it much call it? Sure, maybe not special, but I'm going to keep learning from Pokemon fellow trainers. I swear, there's supposed to be something else here. Seriously, I want to say this is where you get a what call it, which I can't think of right now, a Bananite. This is supposed to be like where you get. Banana, it's a Mega Evolved Banette, which I like, because it, it's a ghost. Well, okay, I'm confused, but that's what was supposed to be here. Maybe it's expecting me to do something else. I don't know. Maybe it's expecting me to have a Banette. Yeah, I'm kind of mentally confuzzled right now. Uh, uh, Alright, I guess I'll just have to leave it. Really? Yeah, I'm just going to drop it. Drop it, walk away. Well, that was a... A little ah, that was a little bit of a letdown, actually. No, I don't want a litly out. Yeah, you're cute and nonsense, but I, I don't want you. 
Okay, no, just, just no. Look, I'm sitting here in my own little self-misery, wondering why in the world was there not a Benenite? There should have been a Benenite. I have these problems, and getting Litleo isn't one of them. Alright, but hey, we got lit, Leo. So now I don't gotta worry about it. That I feel pretty good about. The stronger the opponent faces, the more heat surges from its mane and the more power flows through its body. Or, you know, it could be kind of referring to the fact that, you know, like, you're getting worked up. Seriously, though. Ah! I just can't help but look at that and go just like... I don't get it! Was a spooky plate really is all that's supposed to be there? Is, is that it? I don't know. If I find, I'll do some research on the subject. But if I find out that you need to do something specific, I'll add an annotation and say, "Hey, this is you know this is what I discovered. This is what you need to do." Which just made me realize that now that I said that I'm going to write an annotation, there's probably going to be an annotation there, which we still need to get done there. It's like a reverse thing because now that I realize I just said that I'm going to write an annotation about it. It already happened, which means you guys saw the annotation, which means it's like I'm repeating myself or stating the obvious. Your mind is now blown. Alright, so now we need to finally get to the one, um, station that What's-His-Face is talking about. Wait, no, I want that egg. Damn. There was, a um, some... Lumio Station or something? I don't know. Some nonsense that I didn't really care enough to pay attention. And now I'm looking at it and go, Hey, I probably should figure out what that nonsense was. Now, sure not. Yes, you should. Okay. Do do. Okay. 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 This place is famous for not being able to find anything. They don't put ice in your soda. Can you imagine? I hate ice in my soda. I think I've told you guys that already, but I just do. However, I'm gonna cheat. Hey, 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 you. You wanna ride? Yes. What are you in the mood for? Transportation. Uh, no. Yes. Services. No. Yes. Facilities. No. This is getting a little disappointing. Still no. Uh. Um. This is probably the worst cab ever. Wait, hold on. If I just... If I just casually went up and down without them telling me, which does have an arrow, which is irritating, so I'll get a... Ha! Lumio Station! Yeah! Yeah, totally! I'm really impressed that they actually... What?! You suck! Let me pay 4200 for some... Uh, nonsense, stupid thing. Stop right there! Ah! We always seem to be surprising you, don't we? We're just here to give you something the professor forgot about last time. Central Kalos, Coastal Kalos, Mountain Kalos. There are more Pokemon Kalos than you'll find in those three Pokedexes. Did you know that? That's basically what we're here about. We'll power up your Pokedex for you. National. Cool. You're gonna keep on treasuring the time you give your Pokemon for now, and got this precious time that you fought for. Yeah, whatever. Sycamore! How did you like your prey, Max? It was awesome. AZ ruined it. So the reason I came here to ask you is, I want to give you a pass to Cloud City. Doesn't ring any bells? Cloud City is a city in the southern part of the Kalos region. It's the perfect place for trainers looking to sharpen their skills. So here's your pass for a super high-speed rail to Cloud City. Sweet. Is that sweet enough? No, it isn't. Use it to ride the TMV Super High Speed Rail. Take the take your pass that scan over there. It's an orange machine. Have the machine scan your pass to board the train. Have a fantastic time. Bye. For you. 
Yuki. Yes. Open the door for me. Thank you. Who? This is like a magnet train. Or Kelload Station. Well, this place looks fun. Yeah, whatever. I oh, what's the sticky stuff that Swirks expels to stop its opponent movement? I uh, I'm gonna bet dolls to do to saliva. Dang it. Uh, threads. Ooh, I survive. <laughs> is Swirl no Swirlix is like a little bird one. Whoa, hello. You wouldn't have any Max, would you? I saw you in the parade. That's right. I knew it. You're everything I'd expect someone who holds the honor of Callus to be. I'm so grateful to you for stopping Team Flare. Please take this small token by ooh. Use the versus record to record battle videos and battles with friends or battles in special facilities. What's more, if you connect to the internet, you can upload your battle videos. You can also search the battle videos that others have uploaded by entering a code. Well, that's very nice. Pokey Center. I can amass a lot of BP or battle points and train them for items. I should probably fake. Yeah, I should tell you guys what the battle mace is. This it? Yeah, run by four or five of sisters, that must be it. This is a nice little town. I should explore this little town. But I have a feeling if I did, you guys would get irritated with me. And yeah, whatever. Who cares about fashion? I care nothing for fashion except looking generally presentable. Friend Safari, um, I'm not gonna get on that. Basically what it is, is your game of Pokemon X, ha or your account, or something like that, has this specific number, and this number allows you to go to a specific area of the Poke Center. I'm actually, I'll actually go there just to see what mine is. Uh, go on a Safari. Oh. Alright, so, apparently you need friends. Dang it, it sounds like work. <laughs> I don't want friends. What is this? Ooh. Cool. Right, so I can't really find out what mine is since I don't have Wi-Fi. So I haven't really been able to do stuff. So, let's just go in here. But normally you just get like all these different Pokemon, a bunch of which weren't available in the game, and then you can tr and then you can catch them. But you can only have a certain amount, and everyone else has their own certain amount, so yeah. What is this? Yes! Let's see, battle point, uh... It reduces speed... Uh, okay. Oh, okay, it reduces the speed of in the battle, but allows to hold a special defense, okay. So that can be fairly useful for, you know, gain IVs and stuff. Those involve strategy. Eh. Eh. Cool. Cool. Eh, eh. Eh. Erg. Ooh! Wait a second! Upgrade! Oh! Oh yes! Oh! I'm gonna need a bunch of these! Oh, poor Gunzi! Oh, poor Gunzi! Okay. Ooh, choice specs. That's actually pretty cool. Sorry, I should stop looking. Assault vest? <laughs> Eh, that's not that bad. Yeah, as you can see... Weird. As you can see, lots of different things. Uh, what value of prices do you have? Oh! Um, TMs. That's cool. Alright, so let's check this out. I have, I have a prediction, and it's... Wait, hold on. What? Dawes to Dawns, they don't like eggs. Alright, so I better take out you, and you. I'm just gonna do one battle. Oh wait, oh that's right, I don't got plays again. Dang it. Where's my Pokemon? Yeah, that's it, it's all five. So I just gotta choose one that I sort of want. I don't, I don't really want any more. <laughs> it's like, and no. So basically what the battle point is, is 
challenge. Basically what it is, is it's you have the ability to challenge trainer after trainer after trainer, and sometimes an especially hard trainer pops up, and sometimes and that's the four sisters that I was mentioned earlier. And then sometimes those four sisters, all they have is legendaries, which are incredibly dangerous. All your Pokemon levels are dropped to level 50. If they're lower than 50, they stay lower than 50, which is obviously a bit of an issue. So make sure you at least get them to 50 before getting them in here. And then as you get as you kill trainers, your um what should we call it? So your kill streak, pretty, and pretty much that's what it is, it's a kill streak, gets better and better and better. As it gets better and better, after each battle, you get more and more points. And you can leave at any time, well, you know, between battles, uh, to just, you know, go do other things, go get different Pokemon, do whatever. But your kill streak is only broken when you lose a battle. And then you can spend the battle points on all those cool items we just saw. <gasps> you guys caught all that? So I'm just gonna do one, I mean... Ooh. Four teams of friend or acquaintance. Um, uh, let's see. Single, double, triple. I have never done a rotation battle. Fan Pokemon. Uh, let's see. I have all four of those. <laughs> Alright, let's go for it. Yeah, totally. I don't even know what it is. Okay, which Pokemon would you like to choose? Uh, we'll start with... Drift Blim, have Lucario, have Garchomp, and Greninja, because I'm sorry- Oh, wait, 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 back, 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 what, 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 what is it, Max, what is it? Back, 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 Really quick. Sorry, I'm just gonna show you one battle, since I'm sure you guys can figure it out. I mean, it won't do me any good to show you my kill streak, because all it'll be is just me, you know, going and taking down guys, and I'm sure that gets old fairly quickly. Since I sometimes don't have anything better to say, so I just start throwing out random insults. Alright, and then... No, no, hold on, go back. Peg. Earthquake. Use on you. Yes. Yes. Get rid of stupid double edge. Now you're useful. Alright. I think we're good. I'm gonna. I'm still not gonna put a Venusaur. Oh, something else I should tell you about these battles. You don't get experience from it. I'm sorry. You you just don't. Yeah, totally. I got no idea how these things work. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna send in Drift Blim and Guard Chop, so you can use Earthquake and then Greninja and then Lucario and confirm. Yeah, totally. I, I did just catch a legendary. Let the consecutive rotation battle challenge begin. See, random person. I'm the master of the universe, the mover and shaker of the future. I'm sorry, what? You are pompous, Kip. Oh. ah, There's three of them, okay, so I can't... How does this work? Okay, so fight, hex. Ah, that's bad. Uh, nope, it's not hitting R. Fucking L. So. Oh! Cool! Alright! So I can like switch in Pokemon whenever any turn I want. Alright. Well, you're still leaving in Battle Toys, so. Ah, dang it! Oh! I'm fine. You're still dead. I get it. Alright. This is really interesting because it's like every turn you just switch in someone else immediately and they get to attack. Okay, so like Chespin's right there. So I can fairly safely go... Let's see... Uh, I was really hoping I'd have a good moment to demonstrate it. So I'm just using Fly. He wrote... Oh! Oh yeah, it's because he's moving first. So I use Fly. Ouch. 
And I'm healed, so... And... Smacky! Aw, oh, man. Aw, oh, wait, you got rough skin? That's a hidden ability! You meanie! I want that ability! <laughs> Alright, so... I'm gonna do... Fight... Switch in... Other one. Switch in you, and if I... Brick break, that should be enough. Dang it, that's a dragon typo! Tunk. Man, I am jealous. I wish I had rough skin. I have a rocky helmet. That'd be great. Okay, so you're grass. So I'm gonna fight. Rush in. Yeah, go for it. And over time, these battles will get harder and harder, obviously. And then once you lose once, they'll reset. But really, this is a nice, fun way to do stuff. Get battle points, get enough for Porygon Z, which is, you know, what, what we're all looking What? Am I the only one thinking of Porygon Z here? It's all about Porygon Z! Yeah, shaker of universes. I really let myself get carried away this time. I hope it doesn't affect my future prospects. Wow. Can I leave? Oh, thanks! You get to heal my Pokemon, too. And I get one battle point! Ah. Uh, interrupt. Yeah. So now you can escape. But you can always come back, which is pretty great. And there's supposed to be one last thing. I just want to show you guys this before I'm done. Somewhere around here. Somewhere. Serena's supposed to pop up. Really? Serena? Yeah, Serena's supposed to be here. Oh, maybe not. I don't know, let me look for her. Hold on, this guy's asking me a bunch of different questions. Do I use their move and Pokemon to levitate and then use a the ground type move? I think it could work. What move should I use? Smackdown, Gravity, or Gastro Acid? Well. Well. Gravity does it. It neutralizes Levitate. And so does Gastro Acid, because it's abilities, but I'm going to say Gravity. Yeah, totally. Okay, hold on. Uh. Terrible, terrible blaze. That those are legendary abilities. Just go with mold breaker. It'll it'll bust your way through levitate. Oh. Yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> so you just ask me all these different questions. I'm like, yeah, yeah, whatevs. What? Look, I don't care. <laughs> oh wow, you're actually pretty big. Good. Yeah, I thought Serena was somewhere in this town. It might be that you have to get, like, farther in the Battle Chateau. Oh! It might be that you have to get farther in the Battle Chateau. I mean, I only did one battle, so... If you want to do quickest, it probably is quickest to do double battles. Since you only can put four guys in and, um... It's two on two. So you can, like... So it's, like, easier because you have two Pokemon that can kill them as opposed to just one Pokemon. You know what I mean? You smelling what I'm stepping in? Never use that again. Okay. But Serena is supposed to pop up. And after... And once you bow Serena, she will give you Absolite, which will allow you to make evolve Absol, which is pretty stinking nice. And, um... Yeah, you'll be able to repeatedly battle her. Which is pretty cool. I mean, it's not bad. Electros! That thing's really cool. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, sure, whatever. Come on, just play him! Yeah, I kind of saw that coming. Oh, Mega Oval. I'll just Lucario you. 
Mega Evolve! Okay, so fight, Mega Evolve, close combat. See what you do against this. Full cinematic experience of Lucario Mega Evolve, in which you will now rip out the throat of that Electros. Wait, rip out, rip out the, rip out the what? Hold on! Hold on! Okay, one more other things I want to tell you before going. Um, remember, I forget the guy's name, but the guy that did the inverse bow? You can battle him more than once, once a day, actually. But thank you. <laughs> and I think that's it for the most part. I mean, pretty much everything else I could show you right now. I mean, like, even that one route that we didn't even explore. Oh. Pretty much everything else I can show you, it'd be much more beneficial for you just to look up the locations of stuff. Well, thanks for that battle. I mean, pretty much everything else now, you can just look up specifically for what you're looking for. It wouldn't be very... Erg. It wouldn't be very productive for me to go individually and show you guys. You know? So let me just finish... Let me just finish looking around these houses, and we'll see what we can do. Oh, Scout! Sky Drop! Cool! Try imitating a trainer who uses- You might want to try imitating a trainer who uses it really well. Mainly because while they're in the air, they can't do anything. Which can mess with them a lot. Kyurum! Uh, um, that's the Trio Master from Generation 5. Do you honestly expect me- you, you do? You do expect expect me just to have it lay in a- Well, alright! Oh, I already talked to you. Well, I think that's all I can really do. So, guys, I just want to say thank you. Do that part. Maybe she's in here. I just want to say thank you guys for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it as much as I had making it. I really love Pokemon, so doing a Pokemon game... Nope. So doing a Pokemon game for you guys has just been a blast, and I loved it. And I really hope you guys have been helped. I've maybe able to you know, influence some of your guys' strategies for the batter. Batter. Better. Batter, batter, batter. And if you guys can out there personally think of anything you want me to do, like any kind of video, if there's support for it, I will gladly do it. I kind of, I will admit, I want to restart this game and play it again because it was so much fun. Maybe like only with bugs and Porygon Z, or only with fairies and Porygon Z, but I think this is a great game and Nintendo has really outdone themselves once again. So I just want to say thank you very much for watching, and I hope I can see you guys in the future. Just comment about what you want me to help out with. I do this for you guys. So, see you later!